Hello, today we're going to discuss how to play Butterfree. Butterfree is certainly a weird looking Pokemon. I mean, just look at it. It's a fluffy bug thing with wings attached to it. The deduction here is that it's a bug type, which has the ability to levitate off the ground, thus taunting ground types with its part poison typing. Since Butterfree is poison bug, it is known to fear fire and antidotes, so never use an antidote on a Butterfree during an Osmog. Butterfree is super rare. I don't think you can find one naturally. As the name indicates, as soon as you catch one, it is no longer a Butterfree. This caused the entire species to flee from humanity's grasp and possibly die out completely. It is my belief that you can only gain one through evolution, so simply find a Metapod and evolve it. Congrats! You now own the first completely domesticated butter slave. Let's have a quick look at Butterfree's Pokedex entry from Fire Red. The wings are covered with dust like scales. Every time it flaps its wings, it looses highly toxic dust. As a trainer formerly known as Bugcatcher, I know that the deep seated fear towards Butterfree comes not from its fluffy buggy exterior but its cold and biting scaly wings. For anything that has scales, must be a dragon, or a fish, and I ain't never heard of no flying fish, so it must be an eastern dragon of some description. The battle strategy is to be like a serene graceful dragon that has embraced its slavery, so just set up a bunch of dragon dances. Just keep dancing, even when you can buff no more. Keep dancing and maybe the pain will go away. Then when you're on low health, go for the quiver dance to demoralize your foes into thinking that they're part of a slavery abuse problem. You'll soon find your way to a guilt tripping victory of great prestige. Well done you. One thousand times huzzah. That's all I have to teach about Butterfree. I hope you enjoyed and learned something. How about it? Why not celebrate the no more mega evolution heresy with a like and sub crumble?